It was just a passion, I mean, like for me, just from a very, very young age. But what I normally do is I travel to places around here in Arari, mostly like Kiyombare, where people are, are drinking, like to township scenes where I experience young girls were just playing, uh, old madalas, mm -hmm. just chatting about uh, daily events. Women who are struggling every day to yeah. take care of their children, just like in this scene here, yeah. you have um, a proudly Zimbabwean woman. Just doing the school run with the kids. <laughs> Normally I use uh, acrylic paint. I usually start uh, working on the background first. And use a bit of uh, oil just in the background and then also mix it with uh, acrylic paint. And then also use a bit of uh, change material, fabric material, which I fuse with uh, acrylic paint just to give it a mixed media touch, which is something very interesting. Way from a distance when you're trying to view it, it just blends in, just like oil in paint, but when you come close, that's when you can appreciate the texture. The impact of uh, art in Zimbabwe society is quite, quite uh, important in that uh, a lot of stories haven't been told about the country. So I think the artist's duty is there to tell that story and then it can go all over the world where somebody can really appreciate uh, the story of Zimbabwe in the comfort of their homes without uh, needing anyone to come there to explain it to them.